Welcome back to the J Town Press, and today we're bringing you a story out of Chino, California, which is just outside of Los Angeles. This incident has to do with the free ride of travel, which is guaranteed under the Constitution. There's a big movement right now of people who are out there driving without license plates and driver's license. The government says that it's a privilege to drive, but the Constitution says we have a free ride to travel. Is it right? Is it wrong? Let me know in the comments what you think. Let's see your ID real quick. I don't have my ID on Do you have like registration or something? No, I don't have that. Any reason why? I just don't. Okay. Do you have a license? Yeah, I do. Okay. okay. Is it still good? Uh, it's all good to Okay. What's your first name? My first name is... Can I ask you what more? Like? I pulled you over for registration. So what's your first oh, name? Oh, okay. Oh, for registration? Yes. Yes. What's your first name? Do you have a first name? I do. I do. Okay, what's your first name? Have a first name? I do. Have a Can you provide it to me, please? Okay. Don't something make this more difficult than I mean, it I'm used to be. I'm not trying to make anything difficult. Just like, what are we? What are we? Are we over for yeah, that's it. That's it. It's an infraction. You're detained right now, so you got to provide your information. Come on. Make it simple. The sooner I get it, the sooner you can leave. Really? Yeah. Five okay. Charlie Three traffic. Uh, 12900 number 14 on a Cray Chevy and a 906. I mean, it comes up on the plate, doesn't it? No. I just need your information. Why are you making this so hard? Man? I'm not trying to make it hard. I, just... I don't know your name. The, you might not be the registered owner. You're required to provide ID when you get stopped. Really? I have a lawful reason to stop you. I, I told you that. Uh -huh. So I'm waiting for your name. What's your first name? So what way if I didn't have one then? This is so silly. You're, 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 be, you're being so silly right now. I'm not, I'm not trying to be silly. I'm just saying. If, if so what, do you, then what are you doing? I'm just asking you a question. Okay, and and I said that I just need your first name, your last okay, name. So I, I don't I don't need an ID card. If I, okay. if, if I didn't have a driver's license, then what, what would you need my name? Your first name, your last name, okay, and your birthday. So the three things you have to provide. Yeah. You don't have to give me your address. You don't got to give me nothing no, else. No, but even with that, with that, everything comes up. With that alone, with my with your with my name and my birthday, my address comes up and everything else comes up. Right? I, I don't I don't understand what you're what you're asking. Well, I'm, I'm just saying, what is the whole point of it? I mean. Well, you tell me. I don't know. I don't know what, what the reservation is for providing your okay, information I that I'm I mean, asking. I, so, I, don't, I don't like asking questions. I don't like giving the information. No, that's fine. Uh, but you're lawfully detained, so you got to provide your first name, last name, and, and birthday. No. Those three things. That's it. By law? By law. Really? So, 
a long time ago they decided that they had to tax our, our rights instead of a privilege. I don't, I don't understand what you're, where you're going. Well, the right to travel. You heard of that? No. Right to travel? Not in the state of California. Not in the state of California. You got a vehicle with California plates uh -huh. with a violation. This is a You have a traffic violation. It's a lawful reason for me to detain you. I'm detaining you. I need your ID. Okay. So to have a driver's license, you need to have, it's a commercial purposes. You just said you were traveling. I'm traveling. Traveling with you. Okay. In the state of California, I'm not working. Okay. In the state of California, we require you to provide a ID, picture ID, commercial purposes. Okay. And your first name and the last name and a birthday. That's what I said. But if it's for commercial purposes, if you're traveling, it's it's. Here in the in the state of California, we have the vehicle code. Okay. Vehicle. This is this is my automobile. Okay. It's not the same as a vehicle. Vehicle with commercial purposes. Okay. I mean, it is what it is. Yeah. We're going to tell you. That's terminology. Really. Okay. That's what we're talking about. You know? So are you going to provide me your first name, last name, and birthday? No. Or are we going to go through this this whole charade? I mean, well, what charade is what are you talking about? You know? I can just be on my merry way. I mean, you can once I get your first name, last name, and birthday. Are you willing to provide it? Like I said, I'm just traveling. Okay. I'm not, he's, a, he's a traveler, Sarge. Huh? He's a traveler. Oh, you guys get that a lot? No. no. I'm just letting him know. Okay. Because you proclaim to be a traveler. I know. Oh, I think if you're a nice person, that should be nice. No. No. So is there anything I could say or do to get your first name, last name, and birthday? No, I just don't. I don't like giving out my personal information. Okay. Do me a favor, step on out. Okay. okay. Do me a favor, step on out of the car. I don't know what else I could say or do to make you step out of the car. I'm, I'm, I'm respectfully asking you to step out of your car. Okay. Okay. So what can we do to make this thing easier for everybody involved? Like I said, you can let, let me go on my very way. Okay. I'm going to park the locker around. Okay. Is there anything I can say or do to get you, like you to let, cooperate with us? You can let me just be on be, besides that. I mean, that's not an option. That's not, not right now, it's not an option. How is it not an option? Because you're lawfully detained for a vehicle code infraction. You're required by the state of California to provide your first name, last name, and a birthday. And for a commercial purpose. You have committed a vehicle infraction. I told you what it was already. It's having expired plates. Okay. Yeah. I stopped you for expired registration. Uh -huh. California Vehicle Code Section CBC 4000, uh -huh. subsection A, subsection 1. You keep saying vehicle. This isn't a vehicle, it's an automobile. Automobile section CBC 4000, A1. Okay, you're required to provide your first name, last name, and a birthday. Okay, so is there anything I could say or do to get you out of the car? No. Okay, I'm respectfully asking you to step out of the vehicle. Okay, it's not a matter of consenting. It's I mean, I'm just telling you. Okay. You do know how to go to public service? Yes, I'm doing it right now. I'm serving the public. Who are you? I am right now. Okay. So that's what my back is going I can't answer that question for you. I don't know where you're going. I don't know where you're going with this. You know how you get your check, right? To pay by who? The city of Chino. Of course, they, they say city of Chino. But where do they come from? The from city of Chino. Texas. From Texas. They are from Texas. Okay. Absolutely. Yeah, we did have plate for your. Okay. Travis House, we did have three Chevy. I know. I know it's the city of Chino. It comes from nowhere. It comes from us. Once I get your first name, last name, and a birthday. It's that simple. I mean, you the place on the place, isn't it? I don't know. I don't know who you are. Number eight. The plate stands for No, they don't. No, they don't. I wish they did, but they don't. Well, I wish they did. Hi, Tommy. And that plate goes out to the expired 1021 on an 07 Chevy. And the glass of Malzahn, first of Jose. Who's that? You just said it. I don't know who that is. I mean, I don't know if that's you or if it's not you. You could just rise up to them. I mean, that's what you got a name. You wanted a name. Okay. Hi, honey. 
you want to take my spot over here? Or no, you, you're stay over there. I'm gonna have K1 with uh, the pooch here in a minute. You said he's traveling and does want to provide us information. Is it traveler? Mm. Let's go 40. I don't know if it works like that. Well, I'm not doing any commercial purposes. This isn't a good picture. I don't want to do this. So. I do have the liberty to travel, don't I? And I'll be taxed for it. And off me. Is that the equipment's name? Right? Why doesn't it make you exempt from the vehicle code? Vehicle code, this isn't a vehicle code, I don't want to do it. Vehicle, if you look at the code, I'm just telling you for vehicles. It's commercial, it's something that means commercial purposes. Yeah, for the state of California, required to abide by the California vehicle code. Vehicle code, exactly. Can you stand by with them real quick? Yeah, well. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. Angel's here. Is he going to do the old... Uh... You want to try to work your magic? See if he wants to come out? You don't want to listen to me. He comes out or the dog doesn't have one. He, he, the skis are in the ignition, but he shut it off. It's not running. I'm not worried about him leaving. Ricardo? Hey, Ricardo. Yeah. Hey, see, now that we know who you are, right? So, check it out. Yeah. One of two things. One, you can step out, talk to my guys. We can work with you on whatever to include the to include the dog because, because you're suspended or revoked, right? You're suspended. Your vehicle hasn't been registered since October. It's expired, right? So if you want to get out and talk to my guys, cool. Because here's what's going to happen. At some point, you're going to be removed from the vehicle. Then after that, all negotiations are off. Your dog's going to go to Humane and everything else. So it's your call. You've been given more than one opportunity to exit the vehicle and speak to my guys. I understand you're claiming to be a traveler. But my guy also explained to you mm -hmm. that you had the obligation to be registered in the state of California and that it's a state law. I don't have an obligation. Okay. This isn't a vehicle. It's a, motor. It's a what? This isn't a vehicle. What do you guys consider? It's, a, it's an automobile. So let, let me ask you. If if you're not required to have a license, why did you have one before? Because I did in front of a, my race recently. So. Mm. Yeah. Okay. All right. And I haven't got to so. it. All right. Mm -hmm. So as long as we understand each other, you've been given now four opportunities to exit the vehicle. And you refused every time. Because I don't see the right. I need to be the exit the vehicle. Okay. I was just trying to get my way. To get I'm just, I'm letting you know what your options are. You have no choice but to exit the vehicle. Okay? I understand, I understand your reservations. Look, you guys know what common law is? Say again? Common law? I'm familiar. Okay. Are you familiar with the laws in California? For what? What kind of vehicle? Vehicle off. Okay. And I'm not a driver. You're not a what? Uh, I'm not a driver. That's for driver. Driver is a commercial term, isn't it? Okay. I mean, so. we're talking about it. Look it up. I mean, come on. Are you a sergeant? I am. Who's the superior of both? I am. A lieutenant. Can I talk to him? He's not going to come out here for this. I'd rather I'd want to talk to him. Because, I mean, if you don't know the, the law, then you shouldn't talk to I'm required to know the laws in California. Of course. But for vehicles, right? To include the California Vehicle well, Code, yes. So, he's going to tell you the same thing I'm well, telling you. Let's see him. Let's see him. I'd like to talk to him. I'd like to talk to him. And what, what's going to change? Because he's going to tell you the same thing I'm going to tell him. And then you're going to tell him what? Why are you so sure about that? Say again? Why are you so sure about that? Because that's that the law. Is... There's no cockiness. Hey, don't I'm just letting you know. <laughs> but like I said, I'd like to talk to him. Like talk to him like so, it's only up to you. We've already given you the option. Can I can talk to you? I am the superior. And I'm trying to work with you. You won't even step out of the car that's not registered in the state of California. That's not even registered to your name. Well, you can, so sure you can talk to him after you step out of the vehicle and talk well, to my guys. To him He's not going to come out here. 
He's not gonna work. He's not the field supervisor. I'm the field supervisor. Okay. So he's the, he's the, he's the station. Okay. So okay. He's the I'd station. Like he's the station guy. Okay. 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 So I'll give you I'll give you this option. Let me say I call him right now. Yes. And what happens if he says no? I'm not coming out there. Call him. Okay. Then we're gonna be in that same situation. Well, he's trying to do it. Sure. And you want to defuse the situation? Sure. Need to defuse the situation. You've been given four opportunities to step out of the car. Why do you want me to step out of the car? That's what I don't understand. You see what I'm saying? Do you understand what I'm saying? No, I, I don't understand why you want. Uh, of course you don't, because you're suspended and your and your vehicle is not registered. Because you had a license before. Yeah, before. You don't even know any better. Oh, okay. okay. All right. Y'all It's Ricardo. Ricardo. Come on, man. Listen, I'm giving you a lawful order to step out of the vehicle. I hate stepping away from this spot. Failure to comply with the lawful order will involve me physically putting my hands on you and removing you from the vehicle. Okay? Now, what goes with that is a trip to jail, okay, for obstructing, okay? And your car's going bye bye and your dog's going bye bye. So, please, all I'm asking is for you to comply and step out of the vehicle to prevent all that. Now, this is the last opportunity that I'm going to give you to do so. Okay? Do it in all the, in it, in all the nonsense. And we can talk like, like human beings, you can tell us about philosophy or whatever the case may be, but you have to step out of the park. That is not an option thing you have. No, you don't have to call the owner. I'm giving you, I'm giving you, this is the final opportunity, okay? And failure to comply, to comply with that. So go ahead and put your phone down. Because I'm going to, I'm going to take you out of the car, okay? And if, yes, I am. If you don't comply with me, force is going to be used against you, okay? So, so, Hey, I'm going to get up. Hey, I'm going to get up. Get out of the car. Get out of the car. Okay. Get out of the car, or you're going to get paid, dude. Hey, get off! 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 Give me your other hand now. Oh, yeah, it's, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hang on, I got, hang, I got handcuffs. I got handcuffs. You got them? Yeah. Papa, tu por la 14. Tu por la 14. Tu por la 14. Tu por la 14. Me está chiclando hasta la policía. Yeah. Tu por la 14. Where's that dog? Okay. Yeah, I, I, I grabbed the dog. Need help? Tu por la 14. Got it. Are you around? So. Let's get him to start shower real quick. Yep. You want to roll him over? Oh, it's my side. Sit up, dude. Why am I hand? Why am I hand? I already told you why. Why? Yeah, you are now. Hey, I'm trying to get out of the vehicle. You're better off. You're crazy. Better off. There you are. Failing for what? What are you talking about? Police with force. Come on. Get together. Come on. Okay, good. I'm not going to jail. I'm crazy. There you are. Stop. 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 Stop.
Stop. Stop. Record it. Record it, bro. Checking out the bike. There you go. That, that's 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 why he just pulled over. I don't know. No registration. Oh really? Like that? Yeah, I don't know. I just seen him get tossed around, dude. I was like, yeah. I just got here. I don't even know what happened. So. Yeah, I just seen him get. So I started recording. Here. Okay. Yeah, no worries. Did you see anything happen then? Huh? Did you? Were you here when he came out of the car? No. Oh no. I just got when he's getting tossed around. What's your first name? Mark? Yeah. Um, okay. Hey, so, so real quick, we're just trying to do an interview, make sure that if you saw something that my officers or my partners did, that's why we got to get statements. Okay. Okay. So if you saw any any kind of, I just saw what I was on the video. Okay. You have it on this video? Yeah. Okay. Do you are do you care to share with us so we can no. show our supervisors? No, no. I thought I thought I was getting them to get a hold of his brother or something. I didn't know. Okay. You know this guy? Mm -hmm. I was just there getting dinner with my brother. How's that going? It's going good. Just working. Oh, did you or late shift? Uh, yeah, dude. I've worked all day. I've been here since 6 a.m. All right, man. All right, man. Take care. This guy show up later. He was right by Stop. I have a video of them throwing them around and stuff. So I'm like, all right, well, what's your name? Like, can I say, you get the video? And he's like, no, I don't answer the question. I'm like, all right, cool. So motorcyclist that came out here and was yeah. recording, he uh, he's like, yeah, I have it recorded. Um, I saw your officers basically toss him around. I'm like, all right, cool, what's your name? He's like, I don't answer questions. I'm like, all right, cool. And then uh, I just took his plate down on his bike. So he's like, I'm going to give the video to his mom. I'm like, all right, cool. To his mom? Yeah. So. Wow. Y'all let me know in the comments what y'all think about this video. Was he in the right? Were the cops in the right? We have a free right to travel here in America. It says it in the Constitution. The government says that you have a driving privilege. If y'all have a story that you want to tell, make sure you contact me at the jtownpress at gmail.com. We got new merch. Go over there and check it out. Everything's in the description and pinned comment. The freedom of the press is one of the greatest bulwarks of liberty and can never be restrained. But by despotic governments.